Are you ready to embark on a journey into a world of ancient prophecies, dangerous trials, and forgotten wisdom? Join us at Midnight Murmurs as we delve into the mystical tale of Ariana and her companions as they face deadly guardians and treacherous terrain in search of the evil entity's lair. Don't forget to like and subscribe to stay up to date on all our latest episodes. Chapter 1 Whispers of Fate The old woodland was bathed in a silver glow as the moon hung low in the night sky. Young and talented seer Ariana reclined in her snug den, her thoughts flitting between the worlds of dreams and reality. A vision carried her into a realm full of enigmatic hints and shrouded truths as sleep began to take hold of her. Ariana was standing at the brink of a huge lake in her dream, its surface sparkling with an ethereal light. A tall, shadowy figure was standing on the other shore. A delicate breeze murmured through the woods, carrying with it the distant sound of voices, an echo of a forgotten prophecy. With a jolt, Ariana awakened, her pulse thumping with a mix of excitement and anxiety. She understood that this dream held the key to her pack's future, and it was up to her to comprehend its significance. Determined, she rose from her burrow and gathered her faithful companions, Kieran, a staunch and devoted warrior, and Lila, a clever and talented healer. Together, the trio set off on their journey to uncover the lost Temple of Whispers, a location steeped in ancient mythology and buried deep within the heart of the magical forest. The road ahead was dangerous, packed with tangled roots and weird whispering that appeared to come from the very trees themselves. Yet Ariana's intuition guided them unerringly, her images becoming more clear with each step. After days of arduous trekking, they reached a clearing drenched in moonlight. In the middle stood the entrance to the temple, guarded by a band of weird werewolves. Their eyes sparkled with an ethereal brilliance as they observed Ariana and her friends with attentiveness. You seek the wisdom of the ancients, the leader of the werewolves spoke his voice carrying the weight of centuries. Prove your worth, young seer, and the secrets within shall be revealed. Ariana nodded, her determination unwavering. The trial that awaited her would test not only her physical prowess, but also her strength of character and unwavering belief in her purpose. With Karen and Lila by her side, she faced each challenge with grace and resilience, earning the respect of the enigmatic werewolves. As the last trial drew to a close, the leader of the werewolves stepped forward, his eyes filled with newfound admiration. You have proven yourself, Ariana, he said, his voice tinged with pride. Enter the Temple of Whispers, for within its hallowed halls lies the knowledge you seek. With a final nod of gratitude, Ariana and her companions crossed the threshold, leaving the moonlit clearing behind. The air inside the temple was heavy with ancient magic, and Ariana could sense the presence of countless seers who had come before her. In the heart of the temple, she found the silent oracle, a figure draped in a flowing white robe, their eyes closed in deep concentration. As Ariana approached, the oracle's eyes fluttered open, revealing a kaleidoscope of colors that mirrored the ever-shifting threads of destiny. I have been expecting you, Ariana, the oracle spoke, their voice carrying a weighty wisdom. The prophecy you seek speaks of an ancient evil stirring in the shadows. To save your pack from darkness, you must seek the forgotten wisdom of the ancient library. 
With those words, the oracle vanished, leaving Ariana with a newfound sense of purpose. She and her companions set their sights on the hidden library, ready to face the challenges that awaited them in their relentless pursuit of knowledge and salvation. As the moon reached its zenith, casting a pale glow over the temple, Ariana and her pack set out on their journey. At each step, they grew more determined to unearth the mysteries of the old library and defend their pack from the oncoming menace. The journey ahead would be dangerous, but they were ready to face whatever lay ahead. For they knew that the fate of their pack rested in their hands, and they would not rest until they had accomplished their duty. Chapter 2 Shadows in the Moonlight The Temple of Whispers stood before Ariana and her friends like a guardian of lost wisdom. Its huge stone pillars extended into the night sky, throwing lengthy shadows onto the earth. As they neared, the air appeared to throb with an old energy, and a sensation of foreboding came upon them. Ariana's pulse pounded with eagerness as the party entered the shrine. The room was softly illuminated, the flickering candles forming swirling shadows on the antique walls. The murmurs of the wind appeared to reverberate across the immense room, intensifying the mystery that shrouded the area. As they pushed deeper, they found a group of werewolves, their eyes gleaming with an unearthly light. The leader, a large and menacing beast, strode forward with a look that burned into Ariana's very soul. Why have you come, seekers of the temple? The werewolf leader hissed, his voice ringing with a primal force. We seek the wisdom and direction of the ancients, Ariana said, her voice firm despite the knot of fear in her gut. Our pack is in peril, and we think the temple contains the key to our redemption. The werewolf leader inspected her, his gaze slicing into her like spears. Prove your merit, young seer. Face the ordeal and prove your courage, because only then may you be recognized worthy of the temple's secrets. Ariana steeled herself, her determination radiating through her gaze. She nodded, embracing the challenge put before her. The werewolves took them to an adjoining room where a perilous maze awaited. The walls were covered with elaborate sculptures, reflecting the difficulties and triumphs of those who had come before. The air was thick with suspense as Ariana and her friends ventured into the labyrinth, lit only by the gentle glimmer of moonlight streaming through thin holes. Navigating the labyrinth was a challenge of both wits and instincts. Ariana relied on her seer talents to discern secret routes, avoiding traps and dead ends. Her comrades followed her direction, their confidence in her unshakable. Hours proceeded into what felt like an eternity, but ultimately, Ariana brought them to the center of the labyrinth. There, they discovered a circular room, bathed in a beautiful, ethereal light. In the center stood a huge statue of a wolf, its eyes glittering with an unearthly light. Ariana approached the statue warily, her heart beating in her chest. She mumbled a prayer to the ghosts of the ancients, asking their direction and protection. Then, the statue's eyes began to flash brighter, and a voice boomed through the chamber. You have shown your metal, Ariana, seer of the lunar veil. The temple's mysteries are now yours to unravel. When the voice went away, the statue's shape shimmered, morphing into a doorway. The party passed through, 
emerging into a spacious cavern filled with antique tomes and scrolls, their spines covered with fading markings and inscriptions. They had reached the core of the temple, the hallowed library of whispers. Ariana and her friends understood that within these pages lay the wisdom they needed to understand the prophecy and preserve their pack from oncoming darkness. With great anticipation, they proceeded on their journey, diving into the depths of buried wisdom, the whispers of the ancients guiding their every step. The Temple of Whispers had disclosed its first mystery, but the real grandeur of their journey was only just beginning to emerge. And so, surrounded by the hushed murmurs of many seers, they immersed themselves in a realm of ancient wisdom, determined to decipher the prophesy and combat the emerging evil that endangered their pack. The voyage ahead would be difficult, but with the secrets of the temple at their fingertips, Ariana and her friends were ready to face whatever obstacles lied ahead. Chapter 3 The Silent Oracle At the Temple of Whispers, Ariana and her companions found themselves in a room that resonated with an old force. The air seemed to hum with the voices of innumerable seers who had come before them. In the center of the chamber, bathed in a soothing radiance, stood the mysterious oracle. The oracle's eyes, pools of great wisdom, caught Ariana's stare, and a sensation of profound understanding went between them. It was as if the oracle could gaze into Ariana's inner soul, reading her hopes, concerns, and the weight of her task. You have come seeking wisdom, the oracle's voice reverberated, bearing the echoes of centuries before. The strands of fate have interwoven, and you hold the key to your pack's destiny. Ariana took a step forward, her voice full with expectation. Please, oracle, disclose to us the next component of the prophecy, the route we must walk. The oracle's eyes moved inward, their voice filled with a combination of old sadness and optimism. To solve the prophecy, you must seek the forgotten library, a reservoir of knowledge buried under the veiled mists. It houses the tome that discloses the mysteries you seek. Ariana's pulse leapt with excitement, for she knew that the oracle's words carried immense weight. But how can we uncover this secret library? What difficulties await us? The oracle's ethereal form shimmered, and with emotion, an elaborate chart emerged in the air before them. The chart represented a hazardous road, with jagged mountains and twisting rivers leading to a deep forest hidden in clouds. Marked onto it was a lone, ghostly tree, denoting the location of the lost library. The route is treacherous, the oracle warned, their voice laced with fear. You will endure challenges of both body and spirit. Believe on your instincts and the tie you have with your comrades, for the power of unity shall lead you. Ariana's pals exchanged glances, a mixture of resolve and anxiety mirrored in their eyes. They had endured difficulties before, but the enormity of their journey was expanding with each discovery. Nonetheless, they were firm in their resolve to guard their pack and bring light back to their planet. When the oracle's presence slowly vanished, Ariana thanked them, thankfulness beaming in her eyes. The oracle's parting words stayed in her mind, follow the root of the veiled mists, and within the forgotten library, the curtain of darkness shall be removed. With fresh purpose, Ariana and her friends departed from the Temple of Whispers, going on a trip into the Veiled Mists. 
The route before them was veiled in mystery, their minds brimming with wonder and resolve. Days went into weeks as they crossed the hard terrain, each step bringing them closer to the ghostly tree shown on the map. They braved terrible storms, perilous cliffs, and encounters with secretive animals that challenged their courage. Despite it all, their friendship grew stronger, their common mission fueling their tenacity. Eventually, the ghostly tree came into view, standing as a sentry amid the mist-laden woodland. The branches appeared to whisper secrets, inviting them forward. They approached the old tree, their hands shaking with eagerness. As they reached out to touch the bark, the mists moved and revealed a hidden door going down into the depths of the forgotten library. They plunged into the huge maze of shelves and scrolls where forgotten wisdom sat waiting to be unearthed. With hesitant steps, they stepped further into the library's embrace, the air heavy with expectation and the aroma of ancient paper. Chapter 4 Forgotten Wisdom Deep within the old library, Ariana and her companions stared in amazement at the immense wealth of knowledge that's surrounding them. Shelves upon shelves stretched as far as they could reach, loaded with old tomes and antique scrolls. The air was heavy with the aroma of ancient paper, and the hush within the library felt holy, as if the whispers of buried knowledge lingered in every corner. Ariana's fingertips touched the spines of the books, her gaze studying the titles engraved in fading script. Each volume seemed to carry a piece of the jigsaw they sought, but uncovering the ancient tome that carried important information concerning the emerging evil would be no simple feat as the gang pushed deeper into the labyrinthine library, their footfall reverberated gently, resonating through the immense cavern. They uncovered elaborate puzzles engraved on the walls, their answers concealed inside the text of rare texts. They combed through old languages, decoding obscure symbols and putting together shards of vanished wisdom. The library's guardians, ethereal beings entrusted with protecting the tome, battled them at every turn. Wisps of ethereal light swirled in the air, forming into powerful beings that challenged their mettle. Ariana's comrades battled with courage, their weapons clashing against the otherworldly guards, while Ariana herself leaned upon her seer powers to predict their moves and locate flaws. Each confrontation was a monument to their perseverance and power, and with each triumph, they got closer to their objective. Traps lie buried within the rows of books, systems of ancient genius meant to dissuade those unworthy of the information they sought. Pressure plates caused cascades of collapsing shelves, while sophisticated systems discharged lethal missiles. Ariana's friends proved their ingenuity, utilizing their wits and agility to maneuver past the treacherous hurdles uninjured. As they approached the center of the library, a huge hall bathed in a gentle, golden light, they noticed an exquisite pedestal. It hung vacant, waiting for the old tome that contained the secret to their mission. Ariana approached warily, a mix of excitement and anxiety flowing through her veins. Suddenly, a voice resonated across the chamber, resonating with old wisdom. You have demonstrated your value, seekers of knowledge, it intoned. The tome you seek sits buried within the great archive, guarded by a conundrum that challenges the depths of your intelligence. Ariana's face wrinkled, and her companions crowded around her, their eyes riveted on the pedestal. 
The conundrum appeared in shimmering letters, before them a jumble of words and meanings. Together, they evaluated each sentence, digging into their collective knowledge and experiences, seeking the truth that lied underneath the veil of words. Hours moved into days as they discussed and thought, uncovering the layers of the puzzle. Eventually, a flash of clarity swept over Ariana, and she spoke with firm conviction. The words poured from her lips, each syllable infused with assurance. The room trembled, and the pedestal released a faint glow as a concealed compartment exposed the old tone. Ariana gingerly collected it, holding the weight of centuries-old wisdom in her hands. The tome exuded an aura of ancient power, its pages filled with the answers they sought. As they flicked over the frail material, insights unfurled before their eyes. Long-lost legends of heroes and villains, prophesies spoken through generations, and ancient rites that contained the secret to defeating the growing evil. The group crowded together, their heads close, their words filled with amazement and resolve. In that instant, the old library came alive with their zeal. The echoes of their shouts resonated through the hallways, and the dust of millennia was disturbed by their enthusiasm. They realized that they had discovered the answers they had been seeking, and that they were now armed with the information they needed to confront the difficulties ahead. With renewed enthusiasm, they set out to put their newfound knowledge into action, ready to confront whatever lied ahead with courage and commitment. Chapter 5 Under the Moon's Gaze The hallowed moonlit grove sat hidden deep within the heart of the magical woodland, its beauty known only to those with a connection to the mysterious moon energy. Ariana and her companions paused at the entrance, their eyes enlarged by the ethereal radiance that enveloped the forest in a delicate brightness. The air crackled with enchantment, and a sensation of expectation filled their hearts. Ariana's love interest, named Ethan, felt an odd attraction toward the grove. He was pulled to the moon's dazzling radiance, sense a latent power inside himself ready to be unleashed. The moonlight danced about his features, creating a silvery shine onto his face as he went forward, his attention concentrated on the mystery trail that led further into the forest. Ethan's footfall were timid at first, but as he proceeded more into the grove, a sense of purpose coursed through his veins. The moon's beams appeared to lead him, lighting the route ahead with an ethereal radiance. Shadows murmured secrets in the corners of his vision, urging him onward. Ariana watched with bated breath, her heart surging with a mixture of hope and anxiety. She realized the significance of this moment for Ethan, the possibility it contained for him to unearth a secret ability that may benefit them in their mission. She realized she had to believe in his path, just as he had trusted in hers. When Ethan traveled farther into the moonlit grove, the mood transformed. The forest got denser, creating a canopy of shimmering leaves overhead that filtered the moonlight into a beautiful, dappled radiance. The perfume of night-blooming flowers floated through the air, their exquisite fragrance irresistible. Ariana's friends exchanged looks, sensing the energy that pervaded the grove. They gazed in amazement at the transforming energy around Ethan, their eyes displaying a mixture of wonder and respect. They realized that his voyage will not only shape his personal fate, but also impact the direction of their joint goal. Suddenly, 
The forest came alive with a chorus of murmurs. The breeze carried a beautiful hum, combining with the rustling of leaves, forming a symphony of nature's voice. The trees seemed to swing in tune to the celestial symphony, their branches stretching toward the skies as if seeking to touch the moon itself. Ethan closed his eyes, letting the lovely sounds to embrace him. In that instant, he felt a burst of energy go through his veins, his connection to the lunar energy growing. His body appeared to glow with a sudden brilliance as he embraced the power that lay latent inside him. As the moon soared higher in the sky, its light cascaded onto Ethan, lighting him in a heavenly radiance. The ground beneath his feet shook, and elaborate patterns of moonlight symbols emerged, engraved onto the dirt. Each symbol hummed with a delicate vitality, echoing the murmurs of buried magic. Taking a deep breath, Ethan stretched his palm toward the shimmering symbols, his touch forcing them to ripple and melt together, forming intricate patterns that matched the stars above. The air crackled with electricity as the symbols replied to his call, aligning in perfect accord with his goals. Ariana and her companions gazed in astonishment as Ethan's newfound power blossomed before their eyes. They felt a surge of optimism, recognizing that this transforming voyage had awoken a latent strength within him, one that would definitely assist them in their goal to battle the rising evil. With increased confidence, Ethan looked to Ariana, his eyes filled with resolve and a hint of vulnerability. He stretched his hand toward her, urging her to join him in this newfound connection to the lunar energy. Would you join me? he said, his voice infused with a feeling of purpose. Ariana grasped his hand, feeling a burst of energy stream through her own veins as she linked with the power that's surrounding them. Together, they stood beneath the moonlight, ready to face whatever obstacles lied ahead, emboldened by the magic that flowed through them. Chapter 6 Unleashing the Eclipse The voyage to the veiled eclipse caverns was filled with hazard. Ariana and her comrades navigated hazardous terrain, their footsteps muted by the thick vegetation that hid the road. The air was heavy with an eerie hush, and the weight of their task rested heavily upon their shoulders. The troop proceeded slowly, their senses heightened, and their weapons at the ready. Each step carried them closer to the heart of darkness, where the terrible monster awaited. The sun fell below the horizon, leaving lengthy shadows that appeared to stretch and twist, matching the disquiet within their hearts. Ariana's mind raced, ideas merging with a sense of dread. She couldn't shake the idea that the ultimate showdown would require sacrifices and push them to their limits. Yet she drew strength from her companions, their unflinching commitment and the relationships created through shared struggles. As they continued on, the terrain got increasingly difficult. Jagged pebbles jutted out from the earth, forming a convoluted trail that looked meant to test their fortitude. Ariana's pulse raced with eagerness, her thoughts sharpened by a mixture of dread and resolution. The sound of gushing water resonated through the enormous chamber. They approached a vast abyss, its depths veiled by darkness. The only route over was a tiny stone bridge, its surface weathered with age. Ariana halted, her gaze riveted on the treacherous tunnel that awaiting them. Ethan, Ariana's love interest, came forward, his eyes expressing a steely determination. 
His connection to the lunar energy seemed to strengthen in this moment, filling him with a renewed confidence. With precise steps, he led the way, his actions sure and deliberate. One by one, the group followed, their footsteps echoing on the stone bridge. The gulf below seemed to stretch indefinitely, a terrible emptiness that threatened to take them whole. But their determination held solid, and they crossed to the other side, hearts hammering with a mixture of relief and victory. The air got thick as they walked deeper into the veiled eclipse caverns. Whispers of old incantations resonated through the darkness, their meaning forgotten in the passing of time. The walls were covered with elaborate designs, reflecting the cosmic dance between light and shadow. Ariana's guide, an ancient sage named Eldred, halted before a huge stone door. Engraved into its surface were strange runes, carved with a precision that hinted at old craftsmanship. Eldred's old fingertips stroked the complex patterns, his touch respectful and understanding. The last encounter is beyond this door, Eldred stated, his voice echoing with a tremendous gravity. To uncover the truth and face the emerging evil, you must establish your value through unyielding bravery and unshakable commitment. Ariana's glance met her friends, their eyes expressing the mutual realization of the approaching difficulty. They had traveled too far to turn back now. Taking a collective breath, they readied themselves to confront the unknown that awaited them on the other side. Eldred laid his palm upon the stone door, pouring his expertise and old wisdom towards unlocking its mysteries. Slowly, the door heaved open, exposing a chamber enveloped in darkness. Ariana went forward, her pulse racing with a mix of apprehension and resolve. When she passed the threshold, a rush of wind blew into the chamber, bearing with it the aroma of decay and a menacing presence. The air crackled with black energy, merging with her every breath. She knew the last encounter was coming, and she steeled herself for the struggle ahead. Ariana's comrades followed, each one taking their position beside her, their tenacity and courage reinforced by their joint objective. Together, they would battle the increasing darkness and uncover the truth that lay buried in the shadows. With Eldred leading the way, they went farther into the room, ready to meet whatever lay ahead. Thank you for joining us on this thrilling adventure with Midnight Murmurs. I want to take a moment to express my heartfelt gratitude for your support. I've poured countless hours of hard work and dedication into creating these videos, and I'm so grateful to have you as a part of our community. If you enjoyed our content and want to see more captivating stories, make sure to subscribe to our channel, Midnight Murmurs, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an episode. Your support means the world to me and I can't wait to bring you more exciting content in the future. Thank you again, and see you on the next thrilling chapter.